So I'm at the Cambridge Hackerspace with, well, hackers, obviously, and we have Microbit running MicroPython, and uh, I'm joined here by, uh, well, I recognise Peter at the end, and... Robin. Yeah. Robin, okay. So uh, what exactly are you doing with the Microbit? We're trying to get it always to point north. A compass? Yes. Fantastic, fantastic. And, and how's it going, Peter? Uh, it's uh, early days, but we've worked out how to get the microbit to, um, or to get the compass on the microbit to tell us uh, in degrees which direction it's pointing in. Yeah. Uh, we've also got uh, uh, found a way to uh, get it uh, to dis display an arrow on the screen. Yeah. Uh, it comes with uh, eight built-in arrows to point to uh, the four uh, yeah. directions with the directions with in between. The, yes. And now we're going to get it to show. Uh, which of those eight arrows points most closely to north? Fantastic, and fantastic. That will, will, will be useful to find our way home. Okay, and and, um, and Robin, how? Because I can see you're typing, and I know it's really easy to talk and type and be filmed at the same time. Yeah. Um, uh, how exactly are you achieving this? Uh, you're using MicroPython, yeah? Yeah, we're using the the REPL, so we're just trying stuff out and seeing what it does. Just experimenting. Yeah. And uh, and how are you finding that? It's really pleasant to use. Um, I'm, I've not used that much Python 3 before, so there are like little things that are catching me out. Yeah, but yeah that's a lang language feature rather than the, yeah. the, the, yeah, the REPL. Um, and have you, you had a go, Peter? I right have. Yeah. And um, everything in the, in the API does what you'd expect. So uh, there's a compass module, and uh, there's a, a method in the compass module called heading, and you call that, and it tells you which way the compass is pointing. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Who'd have thought? Who'd have thought? Well, yeah, uh, but you spend your days sort of dealing with a uh, pretty awful API, so, so, so it's um, lovely to. Yeah. Uh, I have something that's yeah, simple and does what. Something that people have uh, put, put thought into. Fantastic. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, guys, thank you very much. I look forward to seeing. Uh, oh, hang on. It's just changed. Yeah. Can you make it change again? Um, or, or can I, I, can so I turn if, it? If we turn it uh, a bit, bit more. Um, yeah, try that. Maybe put in a sleep. Okay, this is live coding. I think it's much. Yeah, that works. Okay, and then if I turn it. Awesome! Oh, well done. Congratulations, chat. That's not north, though. Oh, shh. Don't tell them that. Oh, God. oh it's finished. Oh, it's finished. Okay. Fantastic. Well it's, done. It's certainly pointing <laughs> in a rapid consistent direction. direction. We just need to work out. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So one of the things, I'm going to give you a hint. You need to calibrate the compass before you use it. And the way you calibrate it is by calling, funnily enough, the calibrate function. And when you calibrate it, make sure it's lying flat. Um, so we've done that. Ah. I think it's probably a problem. I think it's maths. probably just that I put the math. Says the a Cambridge educated kind of mathematician in the corner. Okay. <laughs> okay, I look forward to seeing this work. Thank you very much.